Welcome back to 18 News Today. I'm here with Don Sherman from Elmira College. And Don, I hear you're going to be a lifesaver for those last-minute procrastinators for holiday gifts like me. <laughs> yeah, sort of. <laughs> yeah, we're hosting the fifth annual Under the Dome Craft Fair this Sunday, December 8th, at the Murray Athletic Center. The Dome's out in Horseheads. Um, it runs from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Um, $2 admission for those who show up. And, um, yeah, they're going to have a lot of options to get that uh, perfect holiday gift just in time for the holiday season. And for those locals, this isn't the first time you guys have done this, has it, Ben? No, we're, we're at year five now. So, um, like I said, we started five years ago. It was kind of small, and each year it's gotten bigger and bigger. Um, last year we hit 200 vendors for the first time, and we're over 200 vendors again this year. So we're really looking forward to uh, having a pretty big event with a lot of options for shoppers. And you talk about some of those options. What? What are some of the vendors that are going to be in attendance? Like, what are we going to be talking about? Like, locally made food, like uh, locally like made scarves, or what kind of things can people expect to see? Yeah, there's there's a lot of options. We have, like I said, over 200 vendors. We have a list on our website. If you go to athletics.elmira.edu, you can check it out. The full list is there in a short description. But um, yeah, local local artists with. Um, Clothing, crafts, food, um, just about anything you can think of. So, you know, if you're, if you're last minute shopping, or for me, this is way early, but, um, <laughs> you know, you're getting it out of the way early, so it's, it's good. And I know we've covered a couple of these. We've talked to a couple of people at Elmira about these craft shows. What is it like being able to work side by side community members, not only supporting shopping locally, but kind of getting, I know some of the students get involved, they're out helping and volunteering as well as just getting the community together for just a great to cause and a fun time. Yeah, it, I think it's a great event. Um, you know, we, we had over 2,000 people come to last year's event and we're looking to have more this year too. Um, it's just great to provide that opportunity for people to get out of the house, to get something done on a Sunday and um, like I said, get some shopping done. Um, yeah, it's, just, it's just a good time. And you talked about getting out of the house one of the toughest things when getting out of the house as a parent is, what are you going to do with those kids? Now, I heard you guys have the answer for that this year. <laughs> yeah, we do. So we have Santa's Workshop available for parents to drop their kids off if they want to um, really focus on finding that perfect gift. Um, kids can um, spend time uh, doing some crafts, um, drawing, coloring, things like that with some of our student athletes at the college. So um, overall, good time, I think, for everyone who's going to be in attendance. Perfect. And Don, I've only got enough time for one more question. Sure. I know was, you answered it right at the very beginning, but let's close out the way you started. Sure. What time is it going to be? Where is it happening? And all that fun stuff. Sure. So it's this Sunday, December 8th um, at the Murray Athletic Center. It's the Under the Dome Craft Fair. It opens at 9 a.m., runs till 3 p.m., only $2 uh, to get into the door, and then um, stay, stay for the full time and get your shopping done. Awesome. Well, I want to thank Don Sherman for coming in studio this morning. That's all the time we're going to have, but if you want any more information on this event, it will all be on our website, MyTwinTears.com. We'll be back with more news and weather after the break.